Hey folks, I'm in the backyard today because we're going to build a delta loop antenna. I'm going to show you how easy it is to construct a delta loop antenna. Not only that, we're going to also build a Q-match for it, which is going to be your matching section. So you won't need to go out and buy an expensive ballon for it. So we're going to build a Q-match with the delta loop, and then we're going to put it on the air. All right. Now you're probably thinking, why a delta loop? A delta loop is triangular. Wouldn't a square loop or a circular loop work better? No, they're going to work exactly the same. There's no advantage in building a square loop or a circular loop over a delta loop. In fact, they're more difficult to put up because a delta loop, you only need to support two corners. Okay, you're going to feed it at the bottom. So you have three corners in a triangle, right? So you're going to support two top corners and feed it at the bottom. All right, with a square loop, you're going to need to support from four corners, okay? Because you're not really feeding it in the corner. You're feeding it halfway between. All right, so you're gonna you're gonna need four supports on a, on a square loop, so that makes it a little more difficult. And a circular loop is a lot more difficult to build in the first place because how do you support that? Support a circular loop and keep it round. So we're just gonna go ahead and do a triangular loop, okay? A delta loop, all right? Now, I like a delta loop because A, it gives you gain over a dipole, and B, it takes up less space than a dipole. You can actually put up two, maybe three delta loops in the space that you've only put up one dipole. Let's measure it out, put it up, and put it on the air, and then we'll make a video of how of all of that, and you'll see how the, all of that works, okay? Talk to you shortly. To build a delta loop, we need a pretty good sized tape measure. I bought this, it's a 300 foot roll uh, tape measure. You can wind it back up, it's real easy to use. I paid like 40 bucks for it at Home Depot, but somehow I think it's a mistake because now I see it for a whole lot more. Maybe I got lucky, maybe it was on sale. But as you can see, my tape measure is on the ground and it starts from that tree directly in front of the camera there. You see there's a tree back there. You see where the line ends? Okay, that's where I'm gonna start measuring my wires. Hi folks. Hey folks, I just finished building my Q-match. Okay, remember the Q-match is 75 ohm cable. I don't know if you can actually see the writing. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick this up. But anyway, it's a quarter wavelength. Actually, the formula is 246 times the velocity factor divided by the frequency. So in this case, it's 246 times 0.66. 246 times 0.66 divided by the frequency, which I said earlier was gonna be 14205. And that'll give you the length. It comes out to about 11 feet, five, inches or so 11 feet a little bit more than 11 feet 5 inches like 5 and an eighth inches or something like that and I treated it like if it was a patch cord I put a PL259 on it it's all soldered in I, this has my double uh, barrel connector here my double female connector this is going to attach to the 50 ohm coax that goes into the shack the other end is just the PL259 which is going to go connected to a center conductor now this center conductor um, which is this is not a ballon do not use a ballon this is this is just a, a center conductor where i could connect my coax to and then these two little uh ears if i can call it that um this is where i'm going to connect both ends of my delta loop to so this is not a ballon just a center conductor i want you to understand that okay so let me measure out my 70 feet 9 inches of uh of wire connected to this divide that in thirds, and then put my antenna up. See you shortly. Somewhere up there is the finished product. Could hardly see it. I can't see it in the display. But it's up there, next to the 10 meter one. So, let's put it on the air. Tango Kilo 5, Kilo Papa. Kilo Whiskey 2, Hotel Victor. Okay, thank you for the 592 offer. Now, I know you're in contest. I'm in New Jersey. What do you need? Uh, 001, your first contact? Yes, it is. 001, 59001. Thank you very much. Okay. 